Hello, everyone, and welcome to my Coronation Street official. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. In tonight's Coronation Street, 18 June 2024, Rowan Cunliffe, Emmys Cooper, threatened Toya Battersby, Georgia Taylor, with blackmail. On the ITV soap opera, Toya was taken aback when her stepsister, Lean Battersby, Jane Danson, demanded to cover the costs of her infant daughter, Rose's funeral, as a new week began. Toya placed a yellow teddy on top of Rose's baby casket, which George Shuttleworth, Tony Maudsley, had taken outside into the hearse. Toya was encouraged by Lean and Nick Tilsley, Ben Price, but she was incensed to see Rowan standing close by, observing her daughter's farewell voyage. Toya approached Rowan and told him to go before trying to get on with the challenging day. Toya, though, felt that Rose's farewell was contaminated. Later, after Rowan gave Lean the money herself, Lean was compelled to acknowledge that it was because of him that they could afford to pay for Rose's funeral. Lean kept believing in Rowan, whom Toya deemed to be a coercive abuser, and this infuriated and perplexed her. A fractured Lean was informed by Toya that she would never see her again, and Nick also reminded her how her infatuation with Rowan and the Institute was ruining their family. Lean informed Nick that he was the one causing her pain before hurriedly leaving to do an upload. With a promise to reveal Rowan's true nature, Toya went to see him. When they got home, Nick apologized to Toya for all that had happened that day while they were alone in the apartment. A man outside saw the couple kissing again a few seconds later and shot multiple pictures of Toya and Nick. Nick and Toya decided to keep their distance from one another and never sleep together again as they emerged from the bedroom. Upon her return, Lean professed her sincere apologies and acknowledged her responsibility. Nick and Toya retorted that they could all move past the past few days. After that, everything continued as usual at the bistro, although though Toya tried to stay away from Lean's house as much as possible. However, Rowan paid Toya a visit when she was locked up alone, grinning and reminding her that her court fines were entirely his fault. Toya received a message at the apartment with a picture of herself and Nick cuddling, and the two decided that Rowan was the one behind it all, using blackmail to get Toya to pay up and stop bothering. Will Lean learn of Toya's betrayal, or will she comply? Next week, a well-liked figure from Coronation Street will be joining the Institute. The menacing Rowan Cunliffe, portrayed by Emrys Cooper, has recently attracted Jane Danson's character, Lean Battersby, into a cult. Concerns concerning Lean's involvement have been voiced by her sister Toya Habib and fianke Nick Tilsley. To their dismay, the Institute appears to retain a strong hold on Lean even if the cult has severely damaged Toya's life. It was revealed earlier this year that Toya gave birth when she was just 19 years old. Sadly, the baby was stillborn, and Toya entered its remains on the Crimson Playground. She admitted her guilt to Lean and Nick, but was taken into custody after the police found the bones of her infant daughter, Rose, thanks to an anonymous tip. Even though Toya was ultimately freed without being charged, Rowan was clearly the one who had called the police. Toya has also been keeping her secret relationship with Nick from her sister. The story will get more complicated in later episodes when a second cobbler chooses to enlist in the Institute. This week, Elle Mulvaney's character Amy Barlow opens up about how stressed she is out by her busy radio station schedule. Lean puts her in front of an Institute movie in an effort to calm her down. When Toya notices Amy watching the video, she becomes concerned. She is even more taken aback when Amy says she would like to attend the Institute. Amy seemed to have been totally absorbed into the Institute by next week. Lean tells Nick that she will be spending the day taking care of Toya, following her recent hospital admission during Monday's episode. July 8, 
Toya offers to go with her when Rowan calls to ask her to a tasting session for new recruits. Lean is overjoyed to see Amy there as they arrive at the Chariot Square Hotel for the new recruit session. Will Amy fall for Rowan's devious tactics like Lean did, or will she see through them? Fans claim that a legendary character from Coronation Street will make a shocking comeback to the show, and she is there to destroy the creepy institute. The mystery self-improvement group known as the Institute was first revealed to viewers of the ITV soap opera earlier this year. Lean Battersby, a local, became intrigued by this cult, which was led by Rowan Cunliffe, Emrys Cooper, Jane Danson, Lean's sister Toya Habib, Georgia Taylor, and Fayanne K. Nick Tilsley, Ben Price, were both concerned about her involvement, and it didn't take long for her to become a member. The Institute has kept Lean under control in spite of their protests, and she has since enlisted Amy Barlow, Al Mulvaney, in the group. Amy watches a video about the Institute in this week's episode, and she becomes enthralled. So much so that previews for next week imply she gets completely enmeshed in the cult, according to The Express. Lean is ecstatic to see Amy at the new recruits session that Toya and Lean attend at the Chariot Square Hotel on Monday, July 8. Fans now think, nevertheless, that Tracy Barlow, a specific someone, is making a comeback to the cobbles with the intention of bringing the Institute down. As viewers will recall, Earlier this year, Kate Ford's portrayal of the soap classic said goodbye to the program. Tracy decided to leave her daughter Amy behind and head to Spain with her new partner Tommy Orpington so he could start a new job. However, insiders suggested in June that Tracy is expected to make a brief but significant comeback before returning later in the year, according to The Mirror. Viewers are now certain that Tracy will return to save Amy from a cult's grasp. It has been confirmed that Kate Ford, Tracy, is to return to Weatherfield sometime next month. A fan wrote on a Corey Reddit forum. My assumption is that she will return, not only to visit Steve or Tommy O, her new boyfriend, but also because Amy, her daughter, will find herself in a difficult situation as she becomes involved with the Institute. God, please don't. Hope Tracy ends the Institute. Another person said, That's what I'm hoping for. Wrote a third. Someone else said, I think Ken or Steve will raise the alarm regarding Amy giving Deirdre money away. And that's what brings Tracy back. Wrote a third. Someone else said, I think Ken or Steve will raise the alarm regarding Amy giving Deirdre money away. And that's what brings Tracy back. Thanks for watching if you like this video. So please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.